Hello, I'm Moin Salimi Sartakhti, a master student from Amir Kabir University of Technology. Uh, I want to present our paper titled as um, Sport News Summarization Using Ensemble Learning. Uh, at the first, we discuss about introduction and related work. Uh, then we proposed uh, our method and finally I discuss about result and conclusion. Automatic text summarization or ATS is a process of producing a short version of documents by keeping the important information. Uh, text summarization uh, can save time, uh, time, uh, time of user and can be very useful for um, people. Um, text summarization have uh, text summarization has many applications. For example, keyword or key phrase extraction. Uh, also, for question answering, text summarization is useful. Uh, and uh, in addition, we can uh, say in information retrieval system. For example, uh, Google is a sample of. Uh, text summarization uh, use, usefulness. Um, text summarization can be divided uh, in two group: uh, single document, multi document. We can summarize uh, a document a lonely or single document. We we tell, uh, or um, maybe. We have uh, ma ma many documents, number of documents, and uh, we want to summarize all of document into a document. Uh, for, uh, uh, but in our uh, paper, we uh, focus on single document. Technique, technique of uh, these uh, two approach are uh, a bit different together. Text summarization can be um, done abstractive form or extractive form. Abstractive form uh, refers to the human form. Uh, for example, human uh, can uh, reproduce, reconstruct new sentence after reading a book or a story or a passage. Um, another way is extractive form. Extractive, uh, in extractive approach, uh, we uh, score uh, the sentences and finally sort sentences and uh, then we uh, select the, for example, uh, five top uh, sentence based on their scores. Uh, in this paper, uh, we focus on extractive method. Um, related work section. Uh, first summarization system that was uh, based on term frequency uh, was proposed uh, uh, in 1958. And after that, uh, many researchers um, have, uh, has, have done uh, some works on uh, automatic text summarization using different approaches. For example, one of the approaches is matrix factorization approach. Uh, LS8 or latent semantic analysis is a sample of this approach. A sample of uh, uh, a sample in this approach, and uh, negative matrix factorization or NMF is the, uh, another example, another uh, work. Deep learning approach that is uh, that use widely, especially in uh, recent years. Uh, for example, CNN model, bidirectional STM network, BERT, etc., uh, can use to summarize um, document. Another approach is optimizing. We can see the text summarization. Uh, problem uh, as optimizing problem. For example, PSO, FAHP is uh, samples, uh, samples in this approach. 
But in Persian language, uh, unfortunately, Persian language suffers um, from a lack of uh, sufficient researches uh, in this field. But um, one of the first research in uh, for text summarization system in Persian language uh, was done by Mrs. Shamsfard in uh, 2009. Um, or another um, research in Persian language was done by Moin Salimi um, that used uh, Grey Wolf Optimizer in 2020. Okay, uh, we reached uh, we reached to the proposed metric section. Uh, we use some of popular features, sentence feature or word feature. Uh, F1, 2, F9, sentence location, distribution feature, et al., etc. Uh, and uh, latest of them is F9, uh, centrality. Uh, we, we discuss about them. Uh, F1, sentence location. This, uh, this feature um, uh, score the sentence based on their positions. Uh, and uh, sentences that locate uh, first of document give higher score than other sentences. P index I uh, in this uh, formula um, refers to the uh, I's sentences. F2, distributional feature. Uh, distributional feature uh, focus on position of term in the document and you can see formulas of uh, them uh, in this slide but uh, for example um, uh, this feature um, focus on for example first appearance or last appearance of term k term k in the document and it is um, important for f2 that uh, one token, one uh, term or token, uh, how, uh, uh, where is, where is placed in the text. F3, similarity to title. Uh, this feature uh, is clear, I think. Uh, it is, uh, it, it, this feature um, focus on similarity, cosine similarity of the given sentences, given sentence, and uh, title sentence, and uh, the sentence that are more uh, similar to uh, sentence, uh, title sentence will give a higher score than other sentences. F4, sentence length. It is a very naive feature because uh, uh, assume that um, a, a, a sentence that uh, uh, has um, uh, has high lengths uh, have, maybe has uh, maybe give a high value high score uh, in comparison of other sentence. F5, term frequency, I think it is clear too. Uh, term frequency um, um, is used in this feature. F5, uh, F5 um, calculate the score of each sentence based on a uh, term frequency of token, uh, token of the, uh, in the, uh, it, its sentence. Uh, F6, word sentence score. Uh, word sentence score is based on uh, and inspired uh, by uh, TFIDF, but because of our paper uh, is single document, not multi document. Uh, TFIDF, uh, uh, we, can, we can't use TFIDF and uh, we use TFISF, term frequency, inverse sentence frequency not document frequency. Um, F5. F5 or positive words, uh, um, for example, um, uh, 
uh, keyword or key phrase uh, in, uh, that occurs in the in a given sentence uh, is important for F5. And total number of positive words in S index I uh, is equal to score of uh, S index I. F8, latent semantic analysis based. Um, uh, F8 uh, focus on uh, matrix factorization and then dimension reduction in the new latent space and then we can a new represent for a sentence and we can uh, can we can compute the score of each sentence in the new latent space results uh, will show that uh, lsa f8 and f9 that we will see are the best feature among all of the features f9 centrality f9 or uh, centrality focus on similarity of sentences uh, friends of sentence n graph uh, on sentence common n graph uh, n, n grams uh, excuse me n, n grams of sentences and uh, compute the score uh, in this way after we you we compute the scores we combine all of the pe all of the feature uh, with the linear uh, uh, with the linear uh, function uh, you can see that we assign uh, w index i to each of feature we have nine features so we will have nine weights um, Therefore, we have an optimizer problem. We want to um, um, acquire the weight that maximum maximize uh, maximize the score S index K. Find the best way that maximizes uh, the uh, score. So we can use any optimizer. A tool uh, to uh, our problem uh, we use several optimizers uh, contribution of our uh, paper is that in the Persian language we use for for the first time uh, ensemble learning for text uh, for automatic text summarization genetic algorithm uh, gray wolf optimizer and PSO is uh, are our optimizer that we selected final score uh, combine uh, score s uh, index k from, from gwo plus score s index k from genetic algorithm plus score s index k from pso uh, in uh, other words, we use a, a kind of voting between our uh, 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 optimizers. We review uh, all of the steps uh, and uh, um, in, the in the first step we um, get into text, then removing punctuation, removing stop words, then we calculate feature matrix, features matrix, F1 to F9. Then we optimize, then we pass F matrix and W weights uh, to optimizer tool, optimizer algorithm, and calcul calculating S, uh, uh, S index I, uh, score of S index I, and then select N top sentences. And in the in the loop, we compute uh, these uh, variables, and after finishing optimizing optimizing condition, we can uh, apply ensemble learning because we um, 
uh, we get we have now genetic algorithm weights grave wolf optimizer weights and pso weights and uh, final and the final step is producing output uh, okay evaluation phase um, our corpus, our, uh, corpus uh, is um, uh, our corp our corpus uh, gathered from uh, the Varzish tree. Varzish tree is a popular website in um, for Pers for Persian users for Iranian users and uh, www.varzishtree.com is URL of Varzish tree agency. Uh, we gathered uh, uh, 10,000 documents from 2090 to 2021, and you can details of the uh, uh, details of the corpus in the table. Evaluation metrics. Our evaluation was uh, F score or F1 score. That. Um, mm, use precision and recall measure uh, you can see a sentence feature score in test and train phase in the uh, table um, you can see f9 uh, has the highest score among all of this uh, all of the feature features and um, uh, so you can see in the table uh, uh, right uh, right table you can see in a genetic algorithm for genetic algorithm w9 has the uh, highest value highest uh, the highest value uh, and uh, for gray wolf optimizer w8 and uh, for PSO W9 because F8 and F9 are the good feature for representing the sentence and our optimizer uh, uh, could uh, find uh, this issue and it is very important you can see when we use genetic algorithm uh, uh, and grave wolf optimizer in individual form and PSO in individual form uh, in comparison that we use ensemble learning that we combine uh, combined the genetic algorithm grave wolf optimizer and PSO uh, in ensemble learning uh, method uh, we uh, uh, we give, we get the uh, better uh, performance, uh, and, and uh, the, so uh, ensemble learning can be useful uh, in the text summarization, automatic text summarization for Persian language. Conclusion. Uh, our paper was about Persian text summarization on the sports text. Um, in the first step, we created features matrix. Then we apply some of the uh, optimizer individually, grave wolf optimizer, genetic algorithm, and PSO. Uh, finally, we apply a voting, a kind of voting or ensemble learning between uh, optimizers. Uh, then, um, after uh, we use we used ensemble learning, uh, we can um, select sentences with the highest score. Ensemble learning we we, we saw ensemble learning uh, improves the result. Ensemble learning uh, has the um, uh, uh, more uh, performance than um, uh, uh, grave wolf optimizer individually, genetic algorithm individually, or PSO. For future works, we um, propose three 
all uh, points. One of them is employing other ensemble learning methods. Uh, number two, training model on general domain, not specific domain like uh, just a sport. Uh, number three, uh, employing other new optimizer, uh, especially new optimizer, not old optimizer like genetic algorithm. Thank you for your attention and uh, my presentation uh, finished. Thank you.